Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. I do beauty, fashion and lifestyle videos. A little bit of a different video and the only reason I'm doing this is because you know when you always say I'm not that techie so I really over these last couple of months where we've had more time at home I've really thought do you know what I want I want to be a little bit and like no, not techie but understand a bit more about technology and about just basic technology you know nothing nothing too major but just to know how things and I have figured out so much stuff um, you know that probably will be same simple to everybody else but for me they were quite a, it was quite a big thing and I just wanted to do this video just in case anybody else it will save you so much time because by the time I do realize um, what it was that I was meant to do it has taken me a bit of time after which it probably would take maybe somebody else a bit quicker I don't know but I just thought I'd do a quick video just in case it would help somebody else so I didn't even have a printer I only purchased one this year and I could see that I needed one and then I thought you know let's just get one so I did a lot of research and I finally decided on the Canon MG3050 I got it from Tesco with the ink and um, the black and the color and I also researched on which cartridges would not be so expensive to get as well that's another really good point point. and what I also do when I'm printing off um, what I do, I put the paper back in so I can use the other side of it, if, especially if I'm going to scan. Talking about scanning, I didn't even know the printer scanned. And just in case there's anybody else like me, the first time I thought, it's back, playing with my feet. I thought, oh, so just in case anybody else thinks that this, this is how silly I, I was, I, I thought, oh, let me, let me scan. So I put the paper in, in the printer, and then I was looking for a button. Scan. didn't realize you know that where it was connected to and the printer I, I um, with the printer sorry I managed to download the software and go on to the Canon website and I linked it through the Wi-Fi and the Bluetooth I did all of that myself watched videos YouTube videos just to help me with a little bit of it and what I've also now if you want to connect your Canon uh, printer with your iPhone what you'd have to do is basically download an app and then you can do it off your phone as well but because I'm at home quite a lot of the time at the moment I haven't really done that but I probably will in the future so anyway with the scan I was thinking what do you what do you do so I put it in looking for a button and nothing's happening there but you know what let's go and do it let's go and watch a video so what video on and I realized that you do have to like connect it. Now, just some simple steps that will save you so much time. I don't even have to show you. I can just tell you. Right, so bearing in mind, assuming that your printer's connected to the Wi-Fi and you can do all of that, that's fine. Now to scan on the MG3050, what you need to do on your computer, and I have a Windows 10 uh, HP laptop, you go on to, in the little bottom left hand corner where, where it's got the main um, programs and everything, in the search bar there, you put Windows, fa uh, sorry, Fax and Scan. Fax and Scan will come up and then you open that link and once you go on there, you will see another pop-up box and it will say, um, it will bring up some documents and then it will say New Scan um, and bring up like, if you have, well, you have, if you have scanned the obviously they pull it too. And you press new scan, you'll hear it whiz and do its little thing on, on um, the printer. It'll scan it and then you save it. Um, now, another um, thing that I realise is when I'm be, I've been trying to upload things to websites, a lot of them ask for a JPEG file and a JPEG file from my understanding is a smaller compressed file which is easier to upload so you can save as and in the drop down box you can put jpeg sorry so where was i um jpeg and that is like um a compressed file and once you save it in there it will actually be saved in your downloads and no sorry we saved your scanned documents and the mistake I made when I kept thinking, oh, 
I uploaded it before, absolutely fine. Why can't I find it? They're assuming that I put it in downloads, but it's in scanned documents, and then you can name it or rename it to whatever you want. But anyway, I just thought these were some really good little pointers to help you setting up your new um, Canon. I'm sorry that I haven't got any like clips or anything like that, but honestly, this is probably all that you will, you will need. It's so easy and it helped me so much and if it can help somebody else save some time that would just be great apart from that if on the other hand you enjoy beauty fashion and lifestyle videos I, I, I welcome you to my channel and I would love to have you on board because sometimes it does get a little bit disheartening but more than anything than having more I mean it would be nice to have more subscribers I love finding new friends on on the internet and I've met, I have met some amazing people amazing people so I'd love to see you there but anyway let me know if there's anything that you've discovered that's really quick and easy on on the printer or anything else and that'd be great and let's be friends lots of love bye